Well, music lovers can enjoy the sounds of jazz and the taste of the Afro-Caribbean flavors when a Chef and James Beard Award winner launches his new menu tonight in Ann Arbor. Chef J.J. Johnson is here in studio to tell us about the dishes he will be serving up at the Blue Llama Jazz Club. Welcome, Chef J.J. to Live in the D. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. Thank you for being here. Now, you are the new creative culinary director at yes. the Blue Llama Jazz Club. How would you describe the vibe of the jazz club, and how did you create a menu to match it? So the jazz club is vibrant. It's robust. Um, they're celebrating five years. So in the five years, they wanted to rethink their culinary program. And the owner, Don Hicks, reached out to me, a friend, and said, J.J., do you want to come and show, show Michigan your style of food? And the, and the music there is very, you know, you know, when you think about jazz, it comes from the American South, it comes from the Caribbean, it comes from West Africa, and that's where a lot of the music that's getting showcased at Blue Llama is happening, and that's the food that I want to showcase. It's very Afro-Caribbean-centric food, a lot of my background. We have a little bit of sweet potato cornbread here, right? Mm -hmm. We have Michigan green lettuce with, like, a curry buttermilk dressing and ricotta cheese. Um, some jerk prawns. I knew that was, was jerk. jerk. I knew it. Jerk. I knew it. You got some jerk prawns here. <laughs> Go ahead. You can grab me. Listen, really I brought a few. Oh, man. And then, and then, We're trying to be all, you know, <laughs> dignified and be like, so, chef, right. tell us about your food. Meanwhile, we were like, what's on the chicken? That? And then, and then one dish I'm excited about is our ceviche. Okay. So I brought this for you guys to mix up if you're up to I it. Put me, I put me to work. Let's so do it. So this has been marinating a little bit of coconut milk and citrus. Mm -hmm. And the citrus is what cooks the shrimp, yeah, right? Yeah, cooking the shrimp, correct, okay. and the scallops. Okay. And then here, throw in some tomatoes. Onions, Throw like all team in there. Little, work some, makes the dream work. Let's do it. Okay. Some jalapenos. I like jalapenos. Come on, sprinkle some chives in Come there. On, sprinkle chives. that up in there, yes. I'm gonna squeeze a little bit of lime. Yes. Look at that, look at that sprinkle. That's a mean sprinkle. I got to tell you, you cook? No, I don't. Oh, you don't your cook? wife is but watching. My wife is the cook, so I'm you watching sure? Her. You sure you don't cook? <laughs> no. no, let's get a shot and of then this. I'm gonna, it's delicious. And then a little bit of yuzu oil here, just as a. Mm. And then we're gonna just throw this. Chef, this smells amazing. Go ahead, go ahead, jump right in here. Okay, you guys this taste smells a little so bit. good. Go ahead, I got some spoons here for oh, you. Okay. Thank you. He's like, I know these people are greedy. I can no, just take one ahead, look at ahead, them and I know what's happening. Get in there. Mm. What is that oh, fragrance? Man. So there's Something, a little bit of yuzu. Is that the yuzu? Yuzu, some orange juice in there, some citrus, a little bit of spice. I can, I can taste a little bit of all of that. You can taste all of it? Yeah. And you added some love to it too. Oh, I did. <laughs> I did put some love in there. And then we have our our West African peanut noodles. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry, I'm paying attention. No. I apologize. Yeah. <laughs> and these West African peanut noodles are some goat that we've been we braised for about two days, mm -hmm. really slow and low. And then I know you're excited about this yes. dish. Yes. We are it's excited about North this dish. It's our African spice chicken and what's with on here? collard green salsa verde. Oh, collard green. And I sliced it for y'all perfectly. You know, <laughs> perfectly we had a professional sliced. in the house. Yes, definitely. <laughs> So I don't know if you're a, a thigh person or a leg person, but we sliced it perfectly. Listen, this take... menu launches tonight. Thank you so much. Um, tonight at Blue Llama. Mm -hmm. You can get all these items on the menu. You can come eat, or eat it two different ways. You can eat it prefix style mm -hmm. for $55. Okay. Mm -hmm. Or you can eat it a la carte style um, anyway. We also have a beautiful bar menu. Uh, we're doing like an onion uh, burger at the bar. Mm. We have some red wings. I know you were looking at this cornbread, but this is our sweet potato swirl yeah. cornbread right Put here. That in there. Yes, yeah. sir. The salsa verde collard greens. <laughs> I like that. Did I like you taste that. that? No, I like I'm that. Not. I'm about to taste it right now. You eat shellfish? So you gotta get the prawns. So you gotta get the prawn. Head on. <laughs> that is such an interesting interpretation of collard greens, right? Because we usually think of them cooked all the way down. Yeah, I mean collard greens are are so versatile that you can eat them raw. You can you can blanch them. Mm -hmm. You can you can you can you can uh, cook them like your mama cooks them for six yeah. hours, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. But what, what I, I like thinking. to do is I want you to have all that nutritional flavor in the green. I just don't want you to have it in the pot liquor. Right, right, right. <laughs> the pot <laughs> liquor. <laughs> oh boy. And then one, of the, no. and then one of the biggest dishes that I love is going to come out of my so. cookbook, The Simple Art of Rice. I wrote a book all about rice. We're going to do my Poppy Williams red beans and rice. Mm -hmm. Uh, he lived on the Mississippi Delta right there in, in Louisiana. So we are going to have that dish. You can have that when you get your entree. So when you would get this, this beautiful chicken with the collard greens, mm -hmm. that rice will come right to the table for you to add on very steakhouse style. So 
You I know, hope to see y'all up there. No, absolutely. You know what I love about this kind of food is that it's so flavorful. You only need a little bit. Yes. Like you're, you leave so satisfied and uh, satiated. That's the goal. This is so awesome. Good. Chef, thank you so much. I'm trying to decide what I, I'm, I'm going to destroy this during commercial break. <laughs> but no. remind everyone where they can <laughs> visit to try out your new menu. Everybody can uh, show up starting tonight, Blue Llama, Ann Arbor. Mm -hmm. Come get the Afro-Caribbean flavors. We're open Wednesday to Saturday. I hope to see everybody there. Book online. And you can check me out on every social channel, Chef JJ. Come hang out with me. Or you can see me on my cooking show, Just Eats, on Clio TV. The, the jerk prawn, no. That's oh. good. It is buttery we, and perfect. We marinate them for one day, and then we, 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 bro we broil them right on the top for about five minutes to get it nice and caramel. Perfection, my friend. It's Perfection. Good. Thank you for so real. much for being on Live in the D, Chef JJ. Thank